so I'm just brushing my teeth, washing my face and just getting ready for the day. So I like to do this um, every morning because, you know, I take kids to school. So I like to have a fresh face. And um, yeah, so I like to light my candles, open my curtains. Um, sometimes I open windows, but this particular day was freezing, you guys. So I didn't open as much windows as I normally would. So yeah, so I light up my candles um, in my lounge and here is my entryway. And this is my vanity area. The candles are like a ritual, guys. It just makes my house smell fresh as I'm cleaning it. Uh, so now I'm just prepping the twins' milk. So they wake up um, around seven. One twin would wake up and then about half an hour later, the next twin would wake up. And so they've started sleeping through the night. So 6.30 to seven. So I like to have their milk ready as soon as they wake up, just so they get something in their tummies. And I'm just prepping breakfast for my big kids and I. Today, I decided to go with an omelet a nice warm breakfast I try to switch it up so they're not having cereal every morning sometimes it's an omelette sometimes porridge sometimes french toast with a hot drink but um, yeah this morning was an omelette this omelette was off the chain you guys um, I spiced it just right you know how sometimes with eggs you can like overdo it but no today was like on the spot it was delicious so i just fried up some bacon uh chopped up some capsicum and onion so i waited and put those in so yeah like i like to you know i like to have some brown bacon but not burnt and this was low-key just about to get burnt but yes put the capsicum in and onion just to give it some depth and flavor. Now I'm just cracking my eggs and spicing them. I like to spice and season my eggs. I do not just season with pepper and salt. I go all the way, garlic powder, paprika, um, and this is smoked paprika actually, it gives a really nice smell and, and flavor some ginger powder some moroccan spice. now let me tell you about this moroccan spice okay it will rock your world this i like to put in almost everything it's just right man um so yeah i'm making the omelet so my kids uh the big kids are in the other room in the lounge i have the heater going so it's warm and cozy in there for all four of them so my big girl is uh, looking after my little one. And my son's just fluffing around. <laughs> He's starving. He kept coming in like, Mom, is the food ready? I'm hungry. So yeah, so I just divided by three and we're all having omelets and a hot beverage. There's Nixon. There he goes. So now I'm making our hot drinks. My son loves Milo. He has Milo every morning. My daughter loves white tea. Uh, she could have that. She's she's like a tea fanatic like me. Um, I just like black tea with a bit of milk. Um, yeah, so we love our tea. My daughter and I love tea. Let me tell you some. I could have tea in the morning, in the afternoon, and you know what? At night too, why not? So I'm just emptying my dishwasher. This is dishes that were on all night. Then doing some cleaning. The dishes that I was just using, packing some dishes away as the kids have their breakfast. 
I try to have breakfast with them, but honestly, sometimes it's a hit and sometimes it's a mess. You know, us moms, we try to do what we can. <laughs> So Nicodemus got up, so I'm just taking him out of his sleep suit and letting him have a little crawl and a little stretch while I have my breakfast. Nicola has already had his milk, so he's happy in the bouncer. I like to keep him in the bouncer because they tend to spew up a lot um, if I put them down for tummy time or crawling playtime after they've had their drink. So I like to let them drink and then have a little break in their bouncer and then I'll take them out. So I'm just giving Nicodemus his milk. My kids love these bouncers. Honestly, they, whoever created these or invented these is heaven sent because they're so handy. So there's Noelle having a quick cuddle um, while I go make the twins porridge. So I like to, I think I said in the previous video that I bulk cook. So this is oats that I've cooked and I just pour it into ice trays, freeze it and then take that out and put them into Ziploc bags. It's so handy you guys because you just pull out you know like four cubes is enough for one child like it's enough portion so i pull up the cubes put it in a bowl put it in the microwave for a minute put one scoop of milk and a little bit of water just to make it a bit you know loose it depends what consistency your baby prefers but this is so handy so you're not always cooking every morning you know my goodness and then you can switch it up because my babies love wheat bix as well so it's usually you know porridge wheat bix or you know i like to switch it up so they don't have the same thing every morning so there's nicola having his porridge they absolutely love this stuff and there's nicodemus with his porridge So I did have a shower, quickly had a shower, then made my bed. You know, you guys making your bed in the morning, like I try to do it every morning, but it's a hit and miss sometimes. Um, but when it's nicely made and you know, you vacuumed and every room is clean, you just feel so good. Like even if you're having a lousy day, you know, or a low day, that just you know walking through a clean house is everything guys it just keeps your mind at ease it's one less thing to worry about so yeah i'm making my bed i like to fold it over i like the layered look i'm looking for a throw to put on my bed but it's hard to find you know the right color but yeah there's my bed made now i'm doing my makeup so moisturizing that face I like to moisturize the life out of my face um, then I buy some foundation I like to use my fingers guys when I apply my makeup brushes don't work for me like I'll use a brush for bronzer and contouring but everything else I use my fingers I just feel like my fingers you know I can tell them where to go you know the precise location okay <laughs> with brushes i'm so awkward and i end up smearing powder all over my face so yeah i'm just doing um a natural look i don't like to go too much with colors with my um makeup just because i think i have small features and if i were to put i don't trust myself anyway to put color on my lids i feel like it overwhelms my face but yeah, I like the natural browns, the nudes, you know, for my complexion. And then...
So here I'm just applying bronzer um, on my lids, cheeks, and I did some um, blush before. Now I'm filling my eyebrows. I do not have eyebrows. I was not blessed with eyebrows, okay? Um, so I gotta fill mine in, <laughs> especially the ends. But I don't even do like the contour. Like I know a lot of people do concealer to shape or define the eyebrow. I don't do any of that. You know, just, you know, fill it in, put some brows on there. Now I'm just lining my lips with a dark brown lip liner then before that i actually moisturized it with some lip balm then i like to put like a nude lipstick nothing too much guys you know so today i decided to go a little fancy i did a winged lash which i um hardly ever do unless i'm you know going somewhere but yeah, so I usually just do my mascara, but today I decided, you know what, I'll do a wing lash. And you know, you need that, um, a close-up mirror for this, just so they're symmetrical. But you know what, some people are pros at this. Some people will do this, you know, with their eyes closed, literally. But yeah, so I'm putting that on. I, I'm not a fan of fake lashes, so I don't put fake lashes on. Um, I can never put get them on guys I can never get the glue right so I just you know adding a little bit more bronzer a bit of more highlight so this is mascara mascara saves the day mascara will make you look awake baby okay it'll have you looking like you got your life together <laughs> um, so I almost always do updos um, so here I got my braids on I'm doing an updo I try to play around with different styles I the braids look gorgeous when they're down but I never had them down I never have them out because I'm with kids most of the day so and I'm doing stuff like you know laundry I'm always doing a hundred and ten things and I don't want hair getting in the way Hey guys, so this is my finished makeup look. So it's not like dramatic, it's not too much makeup. I like to keep it super, super simple. Um, I do have a wing lash here, um, wing liner. Um, I have my brows done, I do a bit of contouring. Um, I didn't do my edges just because, you know, like I barely have baby hair, but don't judge me. <laughs> And I just did an updo with my braids. Um, I like it better when it's up. I have a lot of kids to deal with, a lot of cooking during the day, and yeah. So it's my simple makeup look. It's my go-to one. I don't put makeup on every day, but if I were, this would be what I'd go for. Sometimes when I'm filming, I do do this look with you guys or for you guys, but yeah. That's it for today, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. If you are a new viewer, please don't forget to click that subscribe button. And if you like this type of content, thumbs up, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Ciao. Mwah, 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 mwah. <laughs>